Anthony, many congratulations. You're into the semi-finals. Another deciding frame win this time against Jack Lazowski. How much, how satisfying is it to be through? Yeah, it's nice to win. Big matches, obviously, quarterfinals, aren't they? Of any uh, ranking tournament. So uh, Jack will be disappointed with the way he played because um, if he plays, then it's you just got to watch. You know, he's that good. Uh, I was scared that I was even going to get a look in a, a shot. Some, you know, because he's beaten me before when um, I was. A, you know the, the the worst paid spectator in there. Like it was, it was just when he plays his his game, he's almost unplayable. So for him to play so badly and struggle was just a bonus for me. Uh, we both struggled with the table, which I was telling you before. It's got to be the best, finest cloth and best table I've played on for ten years. It was just way too good, perfect for us. Well, it didn't look too, too good for you in that, that last frame. It took a couple of visits, but you, you played a really good last frame. You, you must have been pleased with that. Yeah, yeah. A um, couple of bad uh, kisses here and there, like uh, uh, cannons, which is uh, down to the, a bit of tension in the cloth. But I played one good frame. It was the last frame, <laughs> which is always nice. I uh, felt quite calm. And um, I suppose I've been trying to play a little bit too quick, almost, you know, in that match. And I just said to myself, just, you know, three each, you just got to take it every ball, like a uh, pint of blood, a bit more like that. And uh, I felt a bit better, actually. We were speaking yesterday, obviously, a couple of years ago. It was a really emotional and very popular win for you at the, the German Masters. Since then, it, kind of your back problems have flared up a little bit. It, it's not been quite the same form. Did you ever kind of wonder whether you would be competing in these kind of one-table semi-finals again? I thought so. I mean, I thought if I could get my back... You know, just uh, where, where I can actually practice a bit and uh, get down and not miss tournaments and uh, get some momentum going, which I've, I've done so far this year. I thought, I thought if I could do that, then I, I could get back to playing well like I was two years ago. Um, you know, Ricky will tell you and a few others, when you get a, an injury, it's not just uh, the, the, what, the physical thing. You, you lose confidence and you lose your momentum and you can't get going. And, that, and then the players that are playing well, they just seem to be further ahead of where you are, you're at. And it's catch-22, you know, you, you try and play more and then you, you get more injured, it's one of those. So, touch wood, this season I've been all right, been doing some exercises and that. And um, I can do two hours a day, practice, good practice, and, um, I, you know, I can still play a bit. Well, it's really good to see you back playing so well this week. How, how much would it mean to you if you could go on and win the next two games and secure that, that second-ranking title? Yeah, it'd be amazing. Like, one's stupid, two's ridiculous, you know, it's... Um, at my age, uh, I'd forgotten all about thinking about doing that sort of thing. So to do it again would be amazing. Just enjoy, I'm just enjoying this week. You know, like if I win it, great. It would just be a f a fabulous. But this week has been the best week I've, I've had on tour since Berlin. Just because of where we're at and the people that are, are looking after us and the table conditions and everything that goes with the tournament. It's fantastic. I just enjoy myself. Well, it's good to hear you've been having a good time. We've really enjoyed watching you playing. So best of luck in the semis. Thanks very much.